As soon as we took our first steps, our first dream was a cycle. That familiar sound of tring tring was enough to transport our imagination across the world. But then we grew, and that sound, those dreams, got buried somewhere in the deafening noise of traffic. If this wasn't enough, we are spending more and more money every day on fuel, and Mother Earth is paying the price. Cycling is today part of the paradigm that is needed to reduce the toxic emissions and public health risk. It is needed to reduce or improve the energy security of the country and reduce the climate impact of motorization. For the so-called adult society, the worth of a person is judged by the car they drive. Cycles are only for laborers and milkmen. When cities are designed, cyclists are quite literally elbowed out of their right to space on the roads. But if and if a cyclist dares to come out on these roads, it is an everyday contest against death. The Indian cyclist has to dodge cars, buses, and two-wheelers to find his or her place on these roads. हमको तो रास्ता जहाँ देखो जहाँ जाम मिलती बत्ती तो कोई बात ही नहीं ऐसे मोटरसाइकिल वाले गाड़ी वाले चलने नहीं देते जहाँ तक साइकिल की व्यवस्था है साइकिल ट्रैक नहीं है अलग उसके बाद जो है साइकिल वाले को कोई रास्ता नहीं देता साइकिल वाले को कोई कुछ समझता नहीं है तो वो जाए तो कैसे चलाए सम सिटीज ऑफ इंडिया हैव मेड अप्रिशिएबल अटेम्प्ट टू गिव द हम्बल साइकिल इट्स ड्यू Bangalore has a public sharing system and Delhi Metro has started giving cycles on rent for last mile connectivity but another metro city of the country Kolkata has banned cycles on its major roads We're demanding of Kolkata police is that this ban be unconditionally removed a nodal agency be created uh, by the city where uh, all the authorities and all the experts come together citizens come together and uh, design or redesign uh, Kolkata's transportation Developed countries across the world have started appreciating the importance of the humble bicycle in the conservation of environment, health of their citizens and reducing dependence on non-renewable sources of energy. It is time Indian cities start recognizing this too. It is time to grow out of this mindset of lopsided stated symbols. It is time to give our cycle its legitimate space and respect on our roads. It is time for India to become a truly progressive nation.